stories that stick with you. They are memorable or even life changing or maybe sparked action from people in power, but some of them are memorable for the wrong reasons. Tomorrow, KPRC2 investigates. It's taking you on an exclusive journey to the room where some of Houston's most notorious criminal cases are stored. It is called the Evidence Room, and we have a sneak preview to the documentary series now. Take a look. Each case is different. But they're the same, but different at the same time, if that makes any sense. A murder is a murder, but how they are murdered is, you know, the stuff you receive. Anna Trujillo, the stiletto killer. Early Sunday morning, officers say they got a call regarding an altercation in an upstairs unit. When they arrived, investigators say Trujillo opened the door. Moments later, they found her 59-year-old boyfriend covered in blood on the floor. She killed with her, must be about a six or a seven inch stiletto heel. Oh. I think it's this box. And there's still hair on the heel. I would break my neck in a shoe like that. And from what I understand, they were pretty expensive shoes. All I had was my shoe, so I just took my shoe off. And I didn't know what else to do. And I just started to hit him. Her son remained calm as the judge read the sentence, death by execution. Josue Flores was murdered last Tuesday on his way home from school. I had a nightmare the other night. It was so real. You just thought the world was dead. I told him I was crazy. Officers tell us Trujillo stabbed her boyfriend with stiletto heel shoes. The officer has been shot. We need a lot of say the suspect may be responsible for the murders of at least six women whose bodies have been found in or near the Acres Homes area. Defense attorneys had argued that Yates was legally insane and grossly psychotic when she drowned the children. One by one, they described the deaths of the alleged other eight victims of the convicted rail car killer. Again, this is a new documentary series premiering tomorrow at 6.30 p.m. on KPRC2+. Plus, You can catch new episodes each Wednesday at that time. To learn much more about the docu-series and where to watch it, just go to our website, click2houston.com.